Just the strawberry heads. Kiwi skin on. Watermelon rinds. And we know, we know we waste a lot of food, right? We waste a lot of food. Much of it is avoidable. You are probably buying and then throwing out perfectly good nutrition simply because we've forgotten it's edible. Kate Perizzo is an associate professor with the University of Guelph. One of her specialties is food waste. She says while most of us have heard about issues around overbuying or overzealous best before dates, a lot of us are throwing out good food we don't even know we can eat. There's a lot of food that we eat a part of it and we just throw away the other part just kind of just because, isn't there? Yes. Yes. And I would say that this falls under the topic of food literacy. So yes, buying too much food is a problem, but also then you get home and you don't really know what to do with that food. And that's true for parts of vegetables and fruits, especially that we can eat, but we tend not to. And actually, when you think about a fruit as big as the watermelon, the rind is a lot of that vegetable, a lot of that fruit. I actually really like this. Would you eat or do you eat the skin of the watermelon? No. 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 Why not? Because it tastes bad. But it's edible. It is edible, indeed it is. What about like uh, kiwi skins? No, no, no. <laughs> kiwi skin? Yes. 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 Yeah. It's a little weird. It makes sense that not everybody wants to eat everything. If you look around the world, there are lots of things that get eaten in some places and not others. Culture plays a part, food availability plays a part, but is it a little strange that we half eat some foods very willingly and then discard part of it? Absolutely, there are cultural norms and a lot of it is passed down. It's what we're used to eating, it's what we're used to seeing in grocery stores, it's what we're used to seeing in television. <laughs> Shrimp tails, if they're really cooked crispy, they can be kind of good. Is, that, is there anything useful in a shrimp tail? Is that nutritious? So I have heard people say that they like to fry them up and eat them. Shrimp tails? Shrimp tails, no sir. No, never. 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 <laughs> it's hard. Even when it's crispy, it's almost like popcorn. No. I, no. Sometimes I chew on the plastic bottle caps. So radish tops are good. Okay, what, what about the strawberry tops? No. Kate says aside from the peels, rinds, and cores, the greens on top of say root veggies like beets and radishes can also be really good. One of my favorites, and this is something people don't usually think of, is carrot tops. They, after you give them a good rinse, they kind of have a parsley-like taste. Oh, oh. She adds, of course, not everything is edible, but that the good news is it's easy information to find using your favorite search engine. Shrimp tail. For City News, I'm David Zura.